Okay, so ratings for the GMTK Jam um, are in full swing. So I went into Discord and I asked uh, some of you guys if you wanted me to play your games, get some feedback. So here we are. Um, I got quite a few games to go through, so if your game doesn't work or if I don't quite get it, I'll have to jump on to the next one. I'll try my best though. If you want to check out my submission to the jam, it's called a Redux and I'll put a link in the description. Okay, let's get to it. First off, we got Too Few Switches by Floofy. You play as Tony and you're on a mission to for the Cheesy Puff. You switches to turn stuff off and on so that you can take it to the Cheesy Puff. Tony likes Cheesy Puffs. Okay. Let's give it a go. Well, that's cute. I like the movements. All right. Um, let's see. To grab stuff. X. There you go. And C to place. X to place. Oh, okay. Can I go through here? Oh, all right. So that's that's the goal. I thought that was gonna that was gonna shock me or something. All right. Um, so I have to grab the switches, then place them, and can I get to this one? Can I grab it again? I'm gonna place it here. Can I switch it? Okay. Oh, did I forget to switch it before? Put it in, switch, okay. So now I'll grab this one. Put it in, switch, go back for the other one. Okay. It's like a, it's a little puzzle game. Be nice to get some music, but it looks pretty good. Um, this one looks different. Can I put it here? So it doesn't stay. Okay, so if I put it here, I have to time it. Mm. Uh, now. Oh, could I hold it the whole time? Oh yeah, I could hold it the whole time. Okay. Um, can I get this one? Switch. All right. Uh, grab this one. Put it in here. Okay. And now grab the other one. So can I just? Is that gonna squish me or something? That's gonna move me. Okay. Now if I just grab it. Put it here, and I need to go get the other one. There we go. Okay, I see. It's like um, yeah, a little puzzle game. Um, it looks pretty good. Um, it plays pretty good. It it took me a little bit to actually get uh, at first um, how the what was I supposed to do? I guess, but. It's nice. I, it's really cute. It'd be nice to get some some music, but yeah, good job. I like it. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay, so we got Wave Control by Late Wind. Uh, your goal is to use your mouse to mark the opposite sin wave, flatten the curve, and switch between the channels. Uh, you're going to do your heart monitor. Okay. The health bar. Use your mouse to subtract from the wave. Uh, switch between three inputs. Avoid out of control waves like this one. Press start to begin. Uh, okay. Uh, mm, whoa, my health just went down a whole bunch. Um, I'm pressing Q, W, E, but nothing's happening. My health's going up a little bit. Um, am I supposed to? I'm not quite sure what's happening. Am I supposed to follow it? No. Am I? Um, I'm not quite sure what's happening. Use your mouse to subtract from the wave. Okay. Um, let's give it another go. Uh, 
Uh, okay. So if I move up, is that gonna mess me up? No. So am I? Am I supposed to like? How do I flatten it? Uh, I'm really not sure what I'm doing. Whoa, my health! Am I, I'm gonna die. Um, I'm not quite sure what's happening really. Um, I it's quite complex, I guess. I'm not quite getting the instructions. Um, I'll have to move on to the next one. But good job submitting a game. Okay, we got your triangle. Your triangle, and that's why. That's the only thing that you can count on. Anything else might change the way the future. In the future, you need to survive as many waves square as possible. Um, but every time you do so, something in the gameplay changes. You could forget how to move, or you could become in control of fast. Okay, I see. So each wave is different. Construct three. Okay. Yeah. Hold to click the sh click and shoot. Squares don't like you. I don't. Okay, there we got a square. We're still in wave one, so nothing's weird, I guess, right now. I can just move and shoot. Cool. Your triangle. But the background blinds you. Whoa, okay. Oh, that's pretty intense. Uh, I can't quite get it. I'm playing a trackpad, so it's not ideal, but. Uh, just trying to get away from them. Okay. Let's see, wave three. Your triangle, but you use arrow keys. Okay, so now my now I have to move with the arrow keys. Oh, this is pretty awkward to actually move. Like, ah, shoot with the other. Okay, play again. Is it going to be the same? Your triangle. I'm just going to do the first wave again and see if I get the same the same thing again. A new power up has appeared. Where here? Your attack power has increased. Okay, it'd be nice if it changed, like the. I guess some visual feedback that I have a more powerful gun. The background blinds you. Okay, so it's going to be the same. Okay, so yeah, it's kind of neat. Um, don't know how well it actually fits with the out of control theme. Um, but it's cool. I think it'd be some I was curious before to see what the next wave is gonna be like. Um so I think it'd be it'd be neater if um but you are invincible. Okay, so they do change. Or oh, invisible, okay. So they do change. I take that back. I like I like this one because you have to pay attention to where your bullets are coming from. That's pretty nice. Cause that that kind of change just the way that you play a little bit. What's the next one? Uh, but you're uncontrollably fast, okay. Whoa, yeah, this one's, I don't love it as much as the other one because it's just, whoa, just, <laughs> it's just so hard to control. <laughs> um, can I get to way five? I mean, um, Having fun. Okay, let's see what wave five is. Uh, but your enemies too. Oh, so now everyone looks the same. Okay, I like that they look slightly different, so you can kind of tell them apart a little bit. Yeah, okay, it's nice. Nice little game. Good job. Okay, up next we got. Um, legless, press L and B to start. Um, press escape to quit. 
What's L and B? Whoa. Okay. Uh, I don't know what happened there, but okay. Performing the daily checkup. Error. Life support down in sector 72, activating prematurely. Good morning. Okay. Hold. RMB to replenish shells. Oh, what the hell is RMB? Uh, okay. Whoa. Okay. Trying to move forward. This WSD not worth. Uh, can go anywhere. And I'm not sure what RMB is. I don't know if I'm, am I being just an idiot here? Um, I don't know what's happening. I think you did mention that maybe it wouldn't, it would explode on Mac. It hasn't really exploded, but I can't really do anything. Um, all right, sorry, gotta go to the next one. But good job submitting a game again. Okay, we got Shop Endemic by Andy Bob. Shop Endemic, it happened again. A global pandemic has broken out and people are supposed to stay indoors, but who is going to do your shopping for you? I know, right? Uh, so you have to go to the store and get all the stuff you need in a time like this. However, even though you might not know if you already carry the virus, this smells of humor being you don't want to infect anyone else. How to play? Use your mouse and move around. Okay, let's go. Very topical. <laughs> Can I choose if I want to <laughs> wear a mask or not? Oh, I'm infected. <laughs> That's funny. Um, what's that? Is that another customer? Okay. So, am I am I actually supposed to infect them or not? Are the arrows pointing to other people? Do I want to infect them? I mean, I don't really want to infect them. What's in here? Can I can I get groceries? Uh are you infected? Oh no, I just infected him. Oil. Is that was that like one of my whoa, I just went through the wall. Oh shit, oh no. Oh, I'm, I think I'm stuck now. Oops. I think I'm stuck. Okay, let's try that again. I'm not quite sure if I'm supposed to infect people or not. Andy Bob Games. Um, okay, what happens if I choose the other one? Nothing, I think. Okay, what if I just infect people? I mean, I don't really want to do this though. I don't want to infect them. They're coughing. He's infected too. Oh, shit. Um... Yeah, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to infect people or not. Oh, here. I think, okay. I'm assuming that I should avoid people to not infect them. And I should pick up the the items. I guess it'd be nice. Oh, okay. I get it now. The arrows actually point to the items that I have to pick up, right? Let's Let's see. Let's test that theory. Going down here. Uh, where's the entrance? Ah, oh, damn. Uh, 
got it splitting. It's one down here. Whoa, I went through the wall again. Oh, here, yes. Okay, I see. Yeah, I get it. Okay, cool. Um, I guess it'd be nice to have some kind of UI, um, some kind of something telling me actually like how many items I got left. I, I know there are arrows, but it was a little bit hard to understand at the beginning. And maybe a penalty for infecting people. Like if, if I infect too many people, then it's a game over or something. Um, cool, nice, okay, good job. Next one. Okay, we got crate versus barrels. Crates are attacking you. Uh, escape from the crates, are they gonna kill you? You can create new barrels to attack back. When you create new copies of yourself, you can sacrifice some of your own le own levels to give them. The, le the less level easier to level up, the more level easier to destroy crates. Uh, WSC to move around, left mouse click, divide, and right mouse click callback. Okay, I'm on a trackpad, so I don't know how easy that's going to be for me. Whoa, loud music, okay. Um, so I c you cannot attack, but you can divide, okay. Uh, whoa, okay, so that's my life. Can I pick that up again? No, that's just a mini barrel that's floating around now. Oh, it did I get it back? Should I go in this direction? Okay, what happens if I just, oh. Now we're just like five little barrels. Crates apprehended, zero. They're going, they're doing their thing. Okay. Oh shit, okay. Okay, let's let's give it another go. Divide. Call back. Okay, yeah. Can we go can we go get them? Did I get it? Well, I'm I'm, I'm flying now. <laughs> oh crap. All right, let's all right, let's go back. I mean, it feels like out of control. That's mostly because it's kind of hard to move around. You cannot attack, but you can divide. Uh. Yeah, I'm I'm not quite sure. Like I, I know that it said before that if you divide it's easier to get the crates or something. But I just keep dying. Wait, let me just let me read this again. Left mouse click divide. You sacrifice as many levels as you hold and create a copy when you release the button. Uh, call back. You can call back damage clones. Okay. Love loads of freeware games. The less lever the less level easier to level up. The more level easier to destroy crates. Uh okay. Wait, how do I destroy crates again? You can create new barrels to attack back. Let's 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 just give it another go. So the the fewer levels, the easier it's going to be to level up. So if I just have a few ones just going around, 
Okay, I got I got one. Can I just hit it? Okay. I got two. Uh we got four. I'm not leveling up though, am I? Oh, they are leveling up. Okay, I see. Well I got six now. Oh, I get it. Okay, I, oh. Oh I was just I was just getting into it. Okay, I get it. So you have to kind of um balance your levels. That's that's a neat idea. Okay. I'm not quite sure how it fits the theme, but okay, it's a neat idea. I get it. Cool. Cool. We got Gravity Drifter. It looks pretty cool. Gravity Drifter is a platformer, endless runner with a focus on jumping and dashing in order to survive as long as you can while being chased by a hideous creature. Okay. When thrown to the theme out of control by having the movement of the game ever changing due to the busted gravitational system on the ship. Okay. Let's go. It looks cool. See to dash, jump up. Jump up. Okay, so I can dash in the air, I guess. Can I only dash in the air? Yeah. Why am I why am I playing half screen? I'm a fucking idiot. Let's let's go again. Whoa. Jesus. Oh no. Ah god damn it. Oof. I'm gonna play full screen. This is annoying me. I don't know what are those. Oh damn. Oof. That was close. Oh no. I'm gonna give it another go. I just kinda wish that I could that I could dash on the ground as well. Like like there. Oh damn. Yeah, it's it's kinda it's kinda tough to control, I guess. But it's got cool graphics though. I really like that. Are the coins just um like points? I'm not sure if the if the the top left is that is that my life? Oh no. Oh, what's happening? Oh, I like that the whole thing is changing. Oh, this is this is cool. I like that all of a sudden I can't dash anymore though. Can I? No. I like this change. I don't know how I'm supposed to avoid those lasers though. I'm just kind of going through them. Whoa. I didn't see that one. Is the thing still chasing me? I mean, I can still hear it. Oh. Oh, I can still kind of... Oh, I can still do that. I can still dash, but only off the walls. Okay, that's neat. I just would like to... I don't know. I would like to know my health, I guess. I don't know if that's the upper left corner. Is that my... No, because I didn't go down there. Yeah, it'd be neat to know get some feedback for your health but it's nice it looks it looks really cool okay next one we got dub dubgen by everdees 
Uh, the Dubjan, Dubjan's fungi inhabitants have taken it upon themselves to drive you mad with their agitated tunes. Use this your advantage to get back to your happy place. Alright, um, move horizontally with A and D. Jump with spacebar. You can control your horizontal movement in midair. Go, okay. A D to move, space to jump. Okay. Is that whoa? As your madness gauge fills, the world becomes faster and more responsive. Okay. I see. Ow. Oh damn, I shouldn't have done that. Um Oh wow, okay. I, it's cool like I'm intrigued I'm just kind of completing the levels by accident though like I'm just running straight into the exit without actually realizing um so if I jump here can I wall jump no whoa oh oh if you okay if if you actually take too much damage you're done I see so if I just carefully now and then I jump there. Uh. Oh wow, okay. Oh that's that's tough, okay. If I just jump here, jump again, okay, I should I should be able to control it now. Nope. Oh man. Okay, I I see. So that one just shoots the the melody to the sides and this one is just by proximity to it. So that one I can avoid. It's just too fast to avoid it though. Damn. Ah. Oh. Okay, I'm going to give it one more try. I can't avoid this one, so I have to just take the hit. Oh my god. Oh damn, okay. I I really like the idea. Um I I mean I like that you can kind of um you could you could kind of choose I mean you still have to perform it, but theoretically you can choose how much um damage you want to take and that would affect your movement so you would in some i'm assuming that in some cases you you would want to take damage um to actually be able to get to higher places or or jump um further stuff like that the things like it becomes really hard to actually control if you're able to balance that, that would be that'd be really cool because you you have the choice there of okay, I gotta take damage so I can clear this gap. But yeah, nice, nice little game. Okay, cool. We got the purr. A game where you cannot control the main character created during the GMT. Okay, cool. Nothing else. Run game. Honk, but louder. Honk. Cute. All right, play. Move. Oh, I see. So you gotta move the the bird, and then the cat follows. Okay. Let's go. Honk to sleep. Okay, so I can, okay, cool. So he stays there and I can do this. And can I honk again? Yep. <clears throat> Let's jump. Let's go. Okay, this is, it's, it's, it's nice. It's cute. I like the style as well. Jump. 
jump. Oh, oh no, oh, oh no. Whoa. Okay, he fell, I guess. Um, it's fine. Let's just jump again. Uh, and jump again. And jump again. And I don't know what that is. Okay, can you, yeah, go to sleep. Uh, oh, am I supposed to get him there? Are you just going to go there? Oh, I see. Okay. Cool. That was not very clear from the graphics, but okay. Uh, so does that mean that my, yeah, my controllers are, my up and down is now inverted. Now he goes down again. Okay. It's neat. Uh, so what am I supposed to do with this? Okay, I guess I can... Oh, it's just I, I have to push it. Can he help me? Mm, I guess not. Can he help me? No, this is going very slow. Okay, it's tipping. Okay, we're going. It'd be nice if, he, if, if the cat helped too. Just kind of like a teamwork kind of thing. Is he not? Yeah, it's going. Okay, it's going very slow. Oh, sorry. no, come on, come on, cat. Sleep. I, I like the, am I going to kill him? No, okay. Where are those? Okay, let's just jump. I like the, um, the kind of sleep mechanic. So you have to have to switch between like okay like I'm controlling both or I'm just controlling the duck jump oh I didn't make it let's give it another go jump yeah the only thing about it is that like I guess if if I'm just down here with the duck then it just kind of feels like I'm I'm controlling the same character although I, I damn I can clear that gap oh no, I just have to go when it's up here I was just looking at the flag thing okay so if he just falls down here and he goes up oh oh I missed that one okay that's cool that's neat I I like this leap mechanic so it, it kind of forces you to think of them separately um, but yeah, it's nice, and I, I like the aesthetic too. Pretty good, good job. All right, we got Control Q. Mm. Lead by through a series of platforms, aided by Sussy, Sidekick, Flippy, AD, Left, Right, E, Advanced, Dialog, Space Jump, uh, Cut, Copy Yourself, Paste. Okay, this looks pretty good. Oh, you mastered those AD keys. I sure did. And space to jump. I think you were to copy yourself to hold down the button and get past it. Hold on the button. Oh, this button? C? C, V. Oh, okay, there we go, control. Uh, jump. Go. Whoa, I'm stuck. There we go. Okay. It looks really cool. What is that? Next level, I guess. So, 
control C can I just jump down oh nope that was not what I was supposed to do uh, try hitting control X to the leave yourself behind control X oops control X do I, I mean all right so do I want to go all the way down do I do I just have to wait here I'm not sure if this is what I'm supposed to do. It's really taking a long time. Control V, Control C. Oh, okay. Did I just die? Is, is that like fall damage that I'm dying off? So if I, I'm going to control X here and then go down. Can I control C here? Whoa. Okay. I just killed him. Or can I? Control C here and then Control V and then I go up again. But then the door still close. Can I Control X here? No. Um, I might really just meant to write it down. Am I really just meant to write it down? I mean, it's taking a really long time. How long is it? If I create another copy, does it go faster? Not really. I'll just kill him again. Okay, I'm going to wait until we get all the way to the bottom come on okay here we go okay so can I just jump off here yes there's my corpse and here what do I want to go back up now control X control V control V why is that still locked oh I really don't know I'm kind of lost here nope I died um I'm not quite sure what I'm supposed to do I mean I get the mechanic but I don't know where the other switch to open this door is and this ride down it just takes forever um, but it looks really cool alright next one okay cool so we got uh, stroke by bluish green pro warning the following game contains discussions of mortality suffering blood and hospitalization okay uh, you know, you're about to have a choice in the narrative uh, with particular tall text boxes Okay, move WSD, talk space. Okay, let's give it a go. Yep. Please let me stay with her. Sir, we need you to wait outside. 
the room to be cleared to her. There must be something I can do to help. The most helpful thing you can do right now is to wait outside and let us take from here. Okay. I should make my way back to the waiting room and talk to Gus and Isaac, okay? Which way was it? Okay. Yeah, I think this is the right way. Man, what do I tell him? Gus is going to be beside himself for what happened to his daughter and Isaac. Kids going to need a hug for sure. Can I go places? Okay. Well, I should call her sister. What good would it do? She's one. Oh. She'd want to know. Maybe I'll wait to see what happens. She'll want. She'd want to know. So we're calling her. Hi, my It's Eric. Of. Oh, I got some bad news. I'm in the hospital. She had a stroke. Damn. The dogs are sort of tending to her. Okay. Okay. I have to say, I didn't expect it to be so serious by the description. I mean, I know I had a warning. I'm here, kiddo. Right now, I don't know. Okay. All right. Well, my birthdays, okay. Don't be scared. So I bother being scared, okay. Um, I have to say, I don't think the, the music, the sound is not going to come through, but it's quite fitting to the atmosphere. Yeah, just things just happen sometimes. She fell. Yeah. Damn, um, yeah, I, I wasn't expecting this, but I guess it's, it's kind of nice that these things are out of our control, out of everyone's control. So that's a nice take on the theme. Oh, that's Maddie.
Okay. That's how I talk to her. Oh, nice. Okay. That was that was nice. Um quite unexpected really. By the warning I thought it was going to be, I don't know, gory, I guess. But um I think it's a really nice take on the on the out of control idea. Like instead of yeah, instead of just focusing on the mechanics, just telling a story that is out of control for everyone, really. Yeah. Good job. That's a good one. All right. Next we go. Bah. Bark to start. <laughs> I like the graphics. She panic. Oh, what's that one? That one's possessed or something. Is that a wolf? Oh, am I supposed to keep the wolves out? I oh, okay. Plus speed dash stomp plus speed. Okay, I thought I had to herd the sheep. You have to keep the wolves out. Is that right? Do I calm them down by barking at them as well? Or do I? I'm not sure if I'm making it worse or if I'm helping. I think I'm helping. Okay. Uh, a magnetic bork. Okay, so they come close to me. Okay, cool. I like this. So I can just keep them close. I don't know what that. So I have, do I have to? Yeah, I have to. Oh, okay. I have to keep them away from the cloud. Oh, they're freaking out. Oh God. Okay. The big bat wolves have have. Okay. Let's give it another go. Uh, can I bark with space? Oh. Oh, I can dash with uh space. There's another one here. No, go back. Oh, this one's freaking out. Okay. Yeah, I get it. Uh, speed. I'm gonna try to keep it. No, get get the hell out of there. This one's. Can they? If they're panicking, can they panic other sheep? Uh, 
I think I think that's how it works, right? Oh damn. Uh bigger book. Get out of there, get out of there. No, just calm down. Just everyone, calm down. All right, this is pretty good. I, I like it. Um, I like the graphics. I like the Bork. Uh, it's kind of funny. I, I like how it took me a while to actually shadow dog. It took me a little bit to understand if I was actually, I thought I was hurting them at the, at the beginning. Um, and I thought then that I, I was making them panic. But after I got that, like it's it's pretty good. It's it's funny. Whoa, look at look at them. And I like as well that you kind of get a new um, and you get to choose a new power up after each wave. Um, I think that always makes it makes these kind of games like with waves more interesting. Um, yeah, nice one. I like it. Cool. Okay, we got keypad out. Oh, keypad out of control. Try to make calls by using the keypad uh, before any timeout. Okay. Play. Uh oh, damn. Uh, three. Three. Uh, seven. Oh God. <laughs> Two. Nine, two, seven. Is that no? That's nine. We're six. Is that? Oh God damn! Is that six? No, that was nine. Can I go back? Uh, is this? Oh nope. That was the wrong number. Nope. Uh. So three. Three, seven, two, where's nine? Oh, that was six. God damn it. Uh, see, I, I, I thought that, let's, let's do it again. Okay, so zero, three, four, four, zero, three, four, four, five, seven, six, two, four. Four is five. Five. Seven. Six, two. Awesome. Oh, this again. Um, six. No, I got it wrong again. Can I just go back one? No. Oh, God damn it. Look, I like the idea, <laughs> but it's very annoying. Can I just... Can I just do it again? Um, okay. Yeah. One eight eight seven. One eight. Oh, God damn it. Eight seven two o oh, five two two o oh, five two two five. Two, come here, five, okay, call. No, do it. Is that, was that the right number? I guess it was, because it didn't do the other sound effect. I. It would be nice to know if it was the right number. Five, five, it, was this six? Okay, six, I got it right this time, three, one, uh, two, oh, seven, one, or seven, seven, one, and call. Was that right? I don't know if they're right. I mean, I would like to know, like, it'd be, it'd be neat if it had some kind of, like, someone picking up or something, if they're right, it'd be funny. Um, cool idea it's just really annoying but it's it's a really neat idea okay cool 
also before moving to the next one, I think it'd be it'd be nicer. I I can tell that the the six of the nine it had like a um. Let's just go back to it. This yeah, the six. Okay, the six has the the number the 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 black outline coming down from the top. They both have it from the top. Actually, it'd be nice if there was some kind of way to differentiate the six and the nine. But yeah, anyways, good job. Next one. So we got star controller. An alien vision draws near. Uh, the allied intergalactic forces have come up with the ultimate ship to co to combat them. Uh, control WSD. High physics theme of jam since time immemorial. The game controller has been a method through. All right. Mm. Let's try it. Oh, I like that you use the pixelated um, logo. Oh, it's quite small. Uh, let's get up close. Um, and the shoot them up. Uh, instead of controlling the ship directly, you move around. Uh, the astronaut. Okay. Let's go. Oh, I see. So the astronaut. That's actually. So I have to step on the keys to make it move. Uh, do I have to get to those? No. Can I? Oh, that was no good. Can I rotate my ship? Can I? No. Um, okay. Okay, so let's I'll have to be down here, I guess. Uh, up, down. There. Go. All right. Nice. And get the stuff. Whoa, it's like it it's actually harder to control that you think it's gonna be. Just by like because you have to stop pressing the um the arrow when you want to stop. Like you have to move the character away. Cool. What's that thing at the bottom? Is that a is that another enemy? I, mean, I guess it is. Whoa! I didn't want to do that. Uh, I gotta get some health. Nice. Uh, let's get down here and stop and shoot. Whoa! That was that was a big one. Uh, I need to get that. Cool. And am I gonna get him if I shoot there? There. Cool. Level clear. Level two. This icon represents how much fuel you got. You will lose fuel over time getting hit by enemies or bullets. Enemies will drop fuel. Okay. Go. Are they moving now or eh. oh damn. Oh that's hard. Okay, that is tough now. Oh, I got to oh damn. Oh, I need to go get that. That's really t like it's really tough. I think this would um I'm betting it will probably play a lot better on a controller. Um, because you can probably move around faster. Oh, game over. Uh, that's neat. Um, I like the presentation a lot, and I I like the idea of the the little um, astronaut actually on the controller. That's really cool. But it was um really hard to control. I guess yeah, probably on a controller would 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 feel a little bit better, but. 
yeah, I really like the graphics. Good job. Okay, cool. We got lost signal. Uh, you control a robot on a remote planet, and your mission is to escape from whatever this place is. The signal you send is constantly getting lost and distorted, so the robot is getting out of control with every key you press. Uh, a couple of spoilers, I'm not going to read those. When you press a key, okay, I'm just going to give it a go. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay, hit A to restart. Oh, R to restart. Sorry, that's really small. Um, there we go. So, oh, that's going to send me down, isn't it? Yeah, up. No. So, can you only do two commands at a time? Yeah, I guess so. Uh, can I not? Damn. So you can only do two commands at a time. Um, so if I, but whatever it, if I go down, I just kind of, just kind of, yeah, drop me down there. So how are you supposed to do that? Oh, that it let me do three though. Why did it let me do three? So if I do one, two, three. That's not working anymore. Oh man, I don't know. Oh, oh, I stopped it. Oh, so if I do this and then I do this, oh, there we go. Okay. Oh, that that took a while. I think it would be nice to have um, another level, probably, just to explain. Or maybe just a level that was a little bit more obvious that you can cancel um, cancel one of the movements by doing the opposite because I was totally lost there yeah I can do that one uh, so if I go this way yeah but if I go no Oh, almost. Uh, no. Do I just have to time it right? No. Oh, God damn it, I almost have it. I don't know if that's the right way to do it, though. It doesn't seem like it is. Can I go another direction? No, that's not going to work. Mm. Down and... No. Oh, and I don't know. Can I do anything here? No. Okay. Oh, it's so close. I don't know. Okay, I'm, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to... Just one more time. What if I, can I switch again? No. Okay, I don't know. Um, it's, I like, I like the graphics. Um, I think it's a cool, it's a cool concept, but it's really hard to actually wrap your head around it or like, yeah, just find a solution. I think it'd be nice if there were like, um, more sort of tutorial levels, like just kind of quickly, easy levels teaching the mechanic, I guess. Um, but yeah, good job. Nice one. Okay, I think that's all of them. Uh, thank you guys for sending me your games. Um, I hope you got some good feedback. 
if I didn't get your game in here. I'm sorry as well, uh, there were a few of them, a couple that there were for Windows only, I think, and I couldn't play them. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time.